Good morning, guys. Setting up here to get up on the roof. And try to fix this leak on my patio. My plan is just literally to throw as much uh, spray foam at it as possible. It is in a little area where it's kind of a pocket. I'll show you guys when we get up on the roof. Yeah, I'm gonna take you guys with me. We're gonna check out this leak on the patio and hopefully get it fixed right now. Does not want to say, come on. This thing is being a jerk. Got some supplies to bring up. So I honestly don't know what to expect up here because, and I hate climbing up here on this sketchy ladder, uh, this stuff is not going to stay. I gotta figure out a better way to get up here. This is gonna kill me, literally. This ladder is the worst thing ever. It has issues. But I'm gonna try to do this. It's a lot more sketch than it looks, I promise. No fun. I think this will work, or either this is gonna be the, the video, or I bust my ass on YouTube. My roof really needs to be bleached out, that's my next project. But that's where we're going over there, the patio. Okay guys, I think I figured out what's going on here. Looks like water might be going in right here around this flashing. You can clearly see where the water can go underneath that. I think it's dripping down through there. So I'm gonna give this all a good foam right here. And I will show you guys once I have my foam spray open and ready to go. Put a nice coat right along the edge of the roof there. So here's a little illustration of what was going on on the roof. Basically, what was happening is water was flowing down the flashing in the corner of the roof. Now, normally it flows over the top of the flashing and then follows gravity down to the gutters where it will drain. Unfortunately, as you can see here in this picture, water was flowing straight under the flashing and dripping out underneath my patio. And that could be caused by a number of things. Um, objects hitting the roof. Um, things like that. Animals can do that as well. So all we have to do is seal that area to make that water flow properly again. All right, you see where that also has some problems there. I'm gonna make sure I get this whole area really good. And we got our Walmart spray foam here. Perfect for the stuff and I'll get this open. All right, this stuff is really hard to work with, of course, but um, I did my best just to kind of seal up around the, where the flashing was there and then also not block this flashing so the water can still flow down through this gutter and I guess once this stuff dries um, I'm gonna go ahead and clean this gutter out because it's really not the gutter the roof um, I guess I don't need to start sealing the, the cracks here I guess that'll be fine they haven't ever leaked so I'm just hoping this runs now right down through there and doesn't uh, pile up here since I put a big stack of uh, styrofoam right there. Okay guys, it's not the prettiest <clears throat> patch job in the world, but it's there for one reason, to keep that water from getting down in the corner of that patio and allowing it to flow out. I went ahead and put the trash that I found in this gutter over here down at the end, and then I'm gonna get out 
and clean that out once I get down on the ground again. Now the tricky part is getting down. This gutter also leaks in the corner pretty bad. I'm gonna go ahead and seal it up with spray foam. Just gonna put it like around the inside edge here. Hopefully this does the trick. This one always leaks pretty bad right here. When it rains really hard, it comes out of the cracks down here. Where the gutter split. I think that should do it. That should be good enough. I think that's the only place it leaks. Yeah, that's good enough. It leaks right out of the corners here, the cracks, even though it's been sealed up several times. I'm not used to not yelling at the microphone since we have a mic now. All right, now we just gotta clean up. It's made a bit of a mess. Oh, this hose has got 20 kinks in it. Yeah, this hose sucks. wash some of the dirt off, at least uh, dilute it a little bit that I tracked in here. It's gonna rain today anyway, I just wanna get most of it off the... You know, off the pool deck here. I gotta redo this hose bad as soon as I get rocks put in this garden. And now we gotta get our ladder and stuff out of here. And I think we're just about cleaned up. Just gotta put this stuff back in its place. 
unpack this or pack up this foam stuff. It's pretty worthless after you use it once. I'm gonna to toss it. Put our trash can back over here. All these guys got to go out on Monday. Oh, we got a casualty stuck to the broom. And now heading back to the garage. with all our miscellaneous supplies that we used. We'll put this stuff up in the garage. Came out with two cans of foam, which I'll eventually use one day. All this trash goes out tomorrow for trash day. And we're almost done until it rains when we can give it a good test. There's Mr. Binks waiting for me to come back so he can come inside. So this towel is going to get washed. This is my broom for the house. And then we have Windex we have to put back. And we have two amazing spray cans left. They're only $3, so I'm not going to return them. I'll use these. I will use them eventually. Those two can go with the supplies. I know, kitty. And I can't find my other glove. My other glove is somewhere. Not in here. Kitty, I know. Um, well, apparently I lost a glove. <clears throat> but that's gonna do it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Little quick video about my leaky patio. See you guys next time.